Good afternoon. Please like, share, comment, subscribe, and if you're new to the channel, please hit the notification bell. And today we got ourselves a quality check with the Model Y. So without further ado, let's get right to it. So would you look at what we have here? We have ourselves a quality check with the brand new Tesla Model Y. And this happens to be the gray long range. Let's take a look over here at the left side. Let's move along here to the right side. And we're looking for any marks, dings, scratches, anything that would open up our eyes and cause us to reject the vehicle. Um, many of you may know that Tesla has switched over to some new tire brand. Look at this, this is Kumo. Never heard of the tires, but what I've heard is Tesla has switched over tires in order to improve the ride quality. They're trying to make the car sound a lot less on the road when it's traveling um, so i want you guys to, who have these new set of tires to let me know is it is the ride quality uh quieter all right moving along here to the driver's side door as you may notice you want this door to be as thin as possible now looking at this brand new interior this is just a sticker, it's normally black. Uh, many of you know that Tesla has uh, now opted to put the Tesla Hardware 4.0 on the new Model Ys. So taking a look over here, this is where Tesla normally has a big gap. And over here, um, what you may notice is that the gap over here Always watch out for this gap and make sure that it's it's thin as possible. You don't want the car to have any big old gap. Uh, if you do uh, notice any big old gap, uh, report it to your new sales rep. Um, I have seen that this right side has uh, poked out a little bit on some of the newer Tesla Model Ys. Um, so always remember to check the gap, make sure that the gap is less than three millimeters. So for this Tesla Model Y, I will be giving it a pass. Now let's move on to another Tesla Model Y. All right, so we have this Tesla Model Y. It also, it also is the gray Tesla Model Y black spec, just like we just seen on the other Tesla Model Y. And let's take a look over here onto the right side. And for this tires, this one has the Pirelli tires. So um, I'm not sure of how t Tesla decides which tire you're gonna get, but as you may notice, this tires is Pirelli. Um, and uh, let's take a look on this driver's side. Let's take a look over here, checking out these gaps. Always remember to walk around your vehicle at least five times. Okay, this gap over here is a little bit big um, for our liking. So um, I do have an issue with this Tesla Model Y. That left side gap is a little bit too big for our liking. And on the right side is a lot better so I do like that, okay. But unfortunately, due to the fact that it has a gap, I will be giving this Tesla Model Y a fail. Now let's move on to our final Tesla Model Y. All right, so this is our final Tesla Model Y for the evening. It happens to be the 2023 Performance, and this Tesla Model Y has Michelin tires. So taking a look here on the right side, taking a look over here, so you can look at the gap, seeing if it's flush. Okay, um, that gap is a little bit big. And this over here is poking out a little bit. So definitely have ourselves an issue with this Tesla Model Y. Over here, this light is not flush. Right side is okay. So I do like that. Um, so unfortunately, I'm gonna be giving this Model Y a fail. Due to the fact that it is a performance and when you're paying the money for the performance, you at least expect it to be premium and not have any defect. So out of the three Tesla Model Ys today, we've had ourselves two fails and one pass. Unfortunately, that's how it goes today. So always remember to do yourselves a quality check if you plan on taking delivery. All right, thank you and have a great day.